I'll eat my underwear, Wendy. And then you'll be satisfied. We can put this whole thing behind us. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm committed to peace, Wendy. <laughs> I want you to see just how humble I am. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Look at me, Wendy. Hey, guys. Eddie Cartman is one of the best characters from South Park, from my opinion. And today, we're going to watch with you best moments with him in South Park. So let's get started. Let's go. Oh, hey, Eric. <clears throat> Butters, guess what? I have a surprise for you. A surprise? What is it? It's so fucking awesome. You're gonna be so stoked. It's the best surprise ever. Oh boy! You I ready? Yeah. Okay. Just open your mouth and close your eyes and get on your knees. Uh, okay. Hang on a second here. Okay, open your mouth, butters. Some kind of a prison surprise. Yeah, just like some, that. Some 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 rape surprise. Hey, hey, wait a minute. A surprise of humiliation. It's a trick, is it? Well, you're not going to uh, stick something yicky in my mouth, are you? No, only penis. No problem. I swear on my mother's life, Butters. I'm not going to stick anything yicky in your mouth. All right, just, okay, open it. Good. Okay, here it comes. Butters! Uh, oh, hey, Dad! Butters, what are you doing? I'm just try something new. <laughs> Dad. Getting a surprise. <laughs> oh, my God, my, my only son reduced to this. Hey, what is Yeah, I'm just... It's just interesting. It's just some kind of experiment. <laughs> okay. No one said that I'm gay. Just... <laughs> I will try. That is a good kid. He just didn't understand Tourette's was a real disease. Well, I think the only thing left now is for your son to apologize to his little classmate. Well, Kyle? I'm sorry. Uh, what was that? I, I couldn't quite make that out, Kyle. I'm sorry. You're sorry? I, I don't get what you mean by that, Kyle. You're sorry because I... I said I'm sorry, you piece of... Oh, oh, no, don't worry about it, Cal. Now I understand. I've learned to deal with intolerance. Dumb shit, douchebag! And it means a lot that you're standing here apologizing with your dad and lovely mother. Fat Jew! Jew bitch! <laughs> oh, thank you, Eric. Thank you. <laughs> with pleasure. <laughs> what do you about the wedding? Yeah, sure, what about it? I think it's best that when the time comes for the mall to open, you should stay back a bit from the doors. Why? Well, think about it. The first people inside are going to have to take on the brunt of the holiday shoppers from the main entrance. It's best we let Butters and Scott Malkinson go first. While they fight, we can simply slip on by. Well, yeah, I guess that makes sense, but Butters and Scott won't be able to get their PS4s. Yes, that's true, but let's face it, Sir Stan. This is all about you and me getting PlayStations. The rest are simply there to help us get He's through... lying to you! They're just acting like they've given up, but it's a double bluff. Dude! They're going to betray you at the Red Robin wedding. He got the idea watching Game of Thrones. Dude, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Who is that? He's just this old crazy guy that gets pissed off because I'm in his garden all the time. They're gonna lock you in. God damn it, shut up! He talked about it in my garden <laughs> to like three other people. They're gonna lock you in the Red Rock. Yeah, it's better to find another garden if you want to betray someone. That's true. You have a witness. The main, the first rule of all the crimes. No witnesses. Xboxes. That's why he wants you to stay back from the door. <laughs> Very useful advice from the Slavic guy. No witnesses is the best thing ever. What can ever happen with you? So, no witnesses, guys. Uh -huh. Please welcome David Nelson! Good morning, students. How are we all feeling today? <sighs> Try to prepare myself. <laughs> it's not even a word. Stop! 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 <laughs> Eric, be quiet! No, no, it's okay. He'll run out of steam here pretty soon. It takes too long. <laughs> look, 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 look. They put a little... Mr. Nielsen, Stacy, go ahead and send in Eric Cartman. I get it? Shut your fucking mouth! <laughs> Oh, this is the language of truth. This is the language what we have to, what is better to speak. <laughs> and everyone just understand what happened. Just what? So what? The kids already knew these words. It's nothing special for them. I just show how emotional am I right now, right? Right? So shut your fucking mouth, you little piece of garbage. Some miracle words <laughs> to explain yourself. I'll eat my underwear, Wendy, and then you'll be satisfied. We can put this whole thing behind us. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm committed to peace, Wendy. <laughs> I want you to see just how humble I am. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Look at me, Wendy. <laughs> you have to remember he is already naked. There. Oh my god! 
So, are we cool? <laughs> no! <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> wow. Eric, did you shit my table? Eric, did you just take a crap on my desk? <laughs> What's up? What's up? You crapped on your desk, Doug. What's up with that? I don't know what to do with that. You crapped on my desk? Uh, that is unpleasant, surely. I don't know <laughs> what to do with that. I want to clean my desk, but I don't want to touch your shit. The first step. Punch you in the face. Bam. The second one. Go to prison. You can't beat the kids. Oh, you seem to have dropped something, PC Principal. What's this? Why, this is a little boy's underwear. Oh. Why, this is Butter's underwear. What? PC Principal, you have Butter's underwear and now... Oh my gosh, it's got your DNA all over it. This certainly... <laughs> this is pee. It doesn't look good for you. I don't need to tell anyone about this. No, I think we have an understanding. Capiche? Did you just use a term that excludes women from an occupation? Okay, let's back up. <laughs> ah! Did you just say spokesman instead of spokesperson when women are just as capable of selling sandwiches as anyone? Oh, are you purposefully trying to use words that assert your male privilege? Uh, PC principal, you have to know that it's cool that you have you have some rules in your head and you try to be polite. But another kind of a problem, you try to kill the kid. I know he's annoying. I understand that. Okay, but. <laughs> It's better not. No, I'm sorry, I was just trying to frame you for raping butter. It's not polite. Do you think Italian Americans and women are less important? Oh, God. You dare to use words that alienate two communities of people who have to deal with verbal biases like yours on a daily basis? Better to choose the words very carefully. Wah. Push me to this. <laughs> I'm going to the party. I'm a transgender now. You say that, you say that, I feel that I'm a girl. So I want to go to <laughs> women's toilet <laughs> and see <laughs> what? something. <laughs> I don't know. Girls bathroom. All right, I need to tell you something, Wendy. I'm transgender. Mm -hmm. What? Did you notice the bow? I'm not comfortable with the sex I was assigned at birth, so I'm exercising my right to identify with the gender of my choice. Now get out of my way, I have to take a shit. <laughs> And what should you do? What should you do with that? Nothing. Just nothing. We need to respect others' choices, right? Is it right? I don't think so, actually. I, I, I don't think so. I guess that we have to have, like, middle toilet. How we can call it? We have men's toilet, women's toilet, and middle toilet. Toilet for anybody. Anybody who wants to go there. The dolphins, transgenders, men or women who don't want to go to their, like, <laughs> to their toilet. So just do it with no <laughs> restrictions. <laughs> you can do whatever you want. Sounds logical for me. But stay back, Cartman. And he dead. Yeah, very pity. Very pity. Of course he's alive. It's not Kenny, it's Eric. Well, kid, you made an entire town panic. You lost all your friends. And now you're going to juvenile hall for a week. <laughs> Was it worth it? Totally. <laughs> okay, guys, that's my video. See you later. Bye.